Cold Children's Museum presents Home Zone, learning experiences you can do at home. Hello, thank you so much for tuning into the At Home Zone for the Cold Children's Museum. Today we are going to be reading Mouse Shapes by Ellen Stoll Walsh. Let's see what these mice get into. The mice were running from the cat. Hurry, said Violet. Let's hide in here, said Martin. They found so many shapes. After a while, Fred said, I think we lost him. Look, we've been hiding in shapes, said Violet. We can make things with them. Here's a square. A triangle on top makes a perfect house for a little mouse. Now they're creating things with them. A triangle and a rectangle makes a tree, said Martin. The circle is the sun. But these triangles are different, said Fred. Triangles are tricky, said Violet, but any shape with three sides is a triangle. They've got all different types of triangles over here. Fred put two circles on a rectangle. It's a wagon for the little mouse in the house, he said. Two diamonds make a little book for the mouse to read, said Violet. Here's one oval, two circles, and eight triangles, said Martin. It's a fish. Watch out, the cat likes fish, said Violet. Hey, let's make the cat, said Fred. Violet put on the eyes and a nose. Fred stuck on the ears. And Martin added the teeth. It looks just like the real cat, he said only better. Just then, the real cat pounced. The mice ran away and didn't come back until the cat was gone. The cat's too sneaky, said Violet. If only we were bigger. I have an idea, said Fred. The clever mice got to work. I wonder what they're creating. Soon, they made three big, scary mice and surprised the cat. The cat ran away fast. What a scaredy cat, said Violet. Now what can we make for the little mouse in the house? It's time for lunch, said Fred. Let's make him some Swiss cheese. So they did. The end. To extend this book, something that you can do at home is cut out different shapes using different paper and colors and see what things you can create with all of the different shapes that you have. You can also see what different types of things you can draw when you're only using shapes to create. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Have a great day.